Hey guys, it's me, Darth Mulgaming here, and today I have another episode of my uh, Batman Arkham Origins Cold Cold Heart uh, DLC walkthrough. So we're going back to Goth Court to get the cryo coolant from Mr. Freeze, uh, so we can move on uh, to break through that ice with the cryo drill. Hold on a minute, let me uh, reduce the volume from my TV. Oh, there's nobody out here, actually. Alright, then. So, I actually really liked this DLC. It was pretty good. Um, so, yeah. Oh, I know. Yes, take out the, the martial artist first. He's gonna be a problem. I'll take down the cryogenic weapon. Oh crap, I messed that up. And I messed that up too. I'm gonna choke you with that couch and a chance, do I? And punch. Ooh! Punch right in the thigh. That could hurt. Pitsy's here to save you. Oh, Sorry, great. Yes. Got a big guy to deal with. Get ready! Thank you. Okay. Do a takedown. Take down another guy, too. And another one. <laughs> Also another one. Go on! Nice. Yeah. Boom. Head of the road, you bastard. Ho ho. Why do I always mess up the, these takedowns? You know what? I'm just take you with the battering to right to the face. Um Go here, right? Where do I go again, actually? Um, I really have no idea. Oh, right here. Stupid. Oh, wait, is that a victim? Yep, we'll rescue this guy. Break off the ice. guys to deal with. Oh, this is the same vent that we went through before. Get the bastard! Oh yeah. Down and with the takedown in his hand or his wrist. Oh, I know what to do here. Do this um, lab of cryo vapor before the lockdown protocol on this door is disengaged. Here, throw a thorough battering to that. Deactivate the last switch to stop the security lockdown. And kaboom. Here to hack the ventilation system. Emergency. Please engage. For some reason, the first time I did this, I like this was, I was like totally lost. And then 
it was the most obvious thing, like, there was that open door. And I was like, I just wanted to punch myself in the face for that, being such a s dummy. Now's our chance! Get in there and blow the hell! A thermocharged batarang could break up the ice encasing that vantage. Alright, so now we've got a... a... predator mission. I see you up there! Oh. Take out the ice from these things. And we got one last. Oh, we got a victim here of that's frozen. Take care of him. You're the Batman. Yeah, I am the Batman. Okay, let's see what we got here. I still got this one too. I'll take this guy down here with an inverted takedown. Or I can just make this easier on myself and just go by. Instead of having him to or instead of having me to wait until he uh, until he actually goes on. Thank you out. Get off me! Who is that? Way too close together. How am I gonna do this? Uh, they're all down there too. You wanna beat this freak? You're gonna have to try using something other than harsh language. Oh, he's just getting more. <laughs> Guy, we've got four of these guys left. So got that armored guy, and I actually you don't you don't have to actually just do a beat down on him. You can actually do an inverted takedown on him, but that's about it. Other than just beating him down. No 
know what? I'll beat him down instead. Oh crap, he's gonna get another weapon. What the? Let's hope that mine doesn't blow me up. Nope. Okay, so where's that guy that always oh, gonna... Superior Predator. Oh, it's not good at all. Alright, got another victim at 3 out of 20. I'm in shock. What do we got? Oh, another victim. Four out of twenty. This is a way there. Rage took out the penguin. And it looks like he drove off the bat. Uh what? What a bat for us. Do I just go down? Like that. I'm gonna yeah, I guess. Who is he? Ow. <laughs> I always should have gotten a beat. I'll need to evacuate this lab of cryo vapor before the lockdown protocol on this door is disengaged. All right, there we go. What do we have here? There's more going on here than a simple accident. Okay, I'll turn off the commentary the for this here. Skin has the same blue coloration as freezes. I should set up a crime scene. Data analysis indicates that he died from heat stroke, but the control room doesn't show signs of overheating. This is some kind of crystallized chemical residue. Traces lead back into the lab. Here, I should scan for more evidence. Two men struggled. One of them ran out of the lab. That would be the dead security guard I found. prints are a match for Victor Freeze. He must have watched the security guard die. Freeze scavenged what he needed from various prototypes to build himself a super-cooled survival suit. pressure built up inside the tank when ice sealed these outtakes. 
It appears that this guard was frozen by the cryo vapors from the resulting explosion. The evidence suggests the guard was frozen before the tank ruptured, perhaps by Frieza's cryo cannon. These DNA traces are a match for Victor Freeze. Spatter analysis suggests a blunt impact. Someone assaulted Freeze with a weapon. The cannon was knocked over and fired. When the tank exploded, it released a plume of cryochemicals. The plume enveloped Freeze and the guard, but the shockwave knocked the assailant clear. I need to find that weapon. It may have evidence I can use to identify the assailant. DNA analysis confirms the gun was used to bludgeon Victor Freeze, and fingerprint analysis shows Ferris Boyle. It was Ferris. Something was wheeled through this fluid, possibly a gurney. The fluid must have frozen almost immediately for these tracks to have been preserved. Odd. Freeze was secretly doing research on Huntington's Korea. But this is a cryogenic weapons lab. The test subject was... Nora Freeze. Now I know what happened here. Boyle hired Victor to help advance the secret cryo-weapons program within Gothcorp. In exchange, Boyle agreed to devote Gothcorp resources to finding a cure for Nora's Huntington's. But Boyle was more interested in how Victor had managed to put Nora into cryostasis. When Victor realized that Boyle had no intention of following through on their deal, he decided to do the Huntington's research himself. But Boyle didn't like that. The cryochemical cocktail altered Victor's metabolism, as well as the guards. Boyle escaped ahead of the plume and had the lab quarantined. Victor survived, but he knew that leaving the supercooled lab would kill him. So he built himself a suit and utilized an organic supercoolant to keep his core temperature sub-zero. All this violence. He's just trying to save his dying wife. The super coolant Victor uses in his suit is the same fluid I need for the cryo drill. the evidence I've gathered on Boyle's crimes. I'm sorry, Master Bruce. I know you had high hopes for what Ferris could do for Gotham. That doesn't matter now. Victor's plan was never to kill Boyle. He needs Boyle's security access to get his wife out of Gothcorp. That's all he wants. And now, you're going to stop him? I have to. And are you still going to need that gurney? I am. But not for Victor. Now we got five out of twenty. You know what I'm gonna do when I get out of here? I'm gonna have candy for me a nice hot. And then I'm gonna drown you in it. Uh, I'm trying, boss. This time it's over. Oh, I can get a takedown on him. Take it to him. Take down. Oh crap. Look at what I found. Are you kidding me? Oh my 
my gosh. This damn iceberg! You're good right where you are. But, but you can't leave me here! I'll freeze to death! Not my problem. Oh, so you come back to gloat, have you? Oh, I'll hang you with that bloody cape, you hear me? Well, let's see how you're gonna do that. Oh, let me reason. You're not gonna let me go now, are you? Are you? I'm not. I'm just kill. Come on, bad man. Uh, you got a price, yeah. Uh, you got a price. Yeah. I don't care. I don't care about money. I already got all the money I want. Warning! Critical failure again. Getting to freeze. I don't think you guys heard that very well. Sorry. Then join me in my fate. And freeze. Victor, you have to let him go. I'm taking my wife. You can't stop me. I know the truth, and so will the police. Boyle will face judgment for his crimes. It, it was an accident! You don't know what you're talking about! Nothing matters, do you understand? Nothing but my Nora! You've endangered lives all over this city. Nora would never have wanted this. No. What she wants is to live a long life in the warmth of the sun. Her hand in mine. But because of him, she'll only feel the icy touch of a man whose emotions run as cold as the blood in his veins. Alright, then let's do this. So you need to find the control panels for those cryo generators and disable them. My wife still has control, but not Here's one of the thingies. Whatever this thing is called. I, oh crap! Ah, oh, yeah, yeah. He's escaped. Gotta flush him. Try this one. The first time I did this, it wasn't as hard as this. So freeze never actually froze me. Okay, get back up. Where you running? How did he escape? Like, I want to actually take down all of these guys first. What? Oh, crap. He's escaped. Hurry. Please. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up before freeze. Oh, ho Okay, get back up to this vanish point. 
There he is. Oh crap, he found me. Okay, so last reactor is right here. Come on, hurry. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Four please, get over here. Okay. Oof. Let's see how well you'll do when the air freezes in your lungs. Oh, great. Now you're on. Okay, you gotta break the ice. Let's kick some ice. You know, not those horrible freeze puns from Batman and Robin. Now I'll deal with you. Okay, so this boss battle is really actually pretty interesting. You, you gotta take out all these guys too. It's kind of a, a predator mission and a boss battle um, at the same time, which is really cool. So I like how they did that. Interesting. You lost your resolve. I remain as strong as ever. Take him down, and you can only take. You, there's quite a few ways that you can take him down, but you can only take him down uh, from behind once, and then he has like this thing that won't let you even get up behind him. Uh, so you can. There's like these little ice thingies, like Alfred is telling you right now. Uh, you can drop those, or like hit, or not not drop them, but like hit a battering at it, and then they'll fall down. And you can see like these uh, points where you can actually uh, hit hit them down. And you can also take them down uh, through the wall. There's one guy down. Uh, I'll wait until he comes down. Yeah, this is a really inter interesting boss battle. I'll box you in. Oh crap. Well, Batman, come out and do what you can. Okay. You will not stop. You are resourceful, I'll give you that. He's right there. Ah! Okay, I guess the ice formations don't really work. Oh, I know what to do, actually. He escaped. How did he escape? A tightrope takedown. Fool. Find him. Oh. Um. This is not in the best spot for me to actually take him down with the tightrope. Search the area. Actually, if he comes under here, I can I can uh, get him. Yeah, it's a perfect spot. Okay, get back up. Yeah. Oh crap! Oh, zip line takedown! Oh, look at that! That was convenient. That. <laughs> I'll do the rest. Oh, crud! Not as my patience. He's escaped. Another tight rope takedown. My suit is resilient, Batman. I know you're up there. Well, that was nice. Find him. Uh okay. Move out. Damn you, Batman, for forcing my hand. Gosh darn it, I was gonna take him down with the tightrope here. So he's going this way then. Oh 
Oh, here we go. You lost your resolve. Mine remains as strong as ever. You have forced me to do this. Take down, no, I'm too far away. Come on, man. Find him. About now. There we go. So I guess the tightrope takedown is the best takedown uh, for takedown freeze. Oh, this is cutscene coming up, actually. Or not a cutscene, but you need to get now under him in like this little vent while he's uh, handling Nora. You know, trying to save her. So do he's right there, as you can see. If I can get underneath him, I can take him from below. I'm the bat. Climb up this little thing here, break the ice, and get under him. Thanks for doing the heavy lifting, but you shouldn't have stuck your nose in my business. And here I thought I was going to have a problem explaining what happened in your lab. I mean, the police are never going to look at me after what you did. And with this bat freak dead, there won't be anyone left to say otherwise. Cryogenic containment failing. And that just leaves you. Please, you can save her. You just have to bypass the cryogenic. Victor! Stop! But I'll keep you alive long enough to see her go! No! Oh, you little... Hey, you are gonna go on a journey. That's it uh, for um, the Cold Cold Heart DLC. Hope you guys all enjoyed. Uh, be sure to leave a like, comment, touch base, and subscribe. There's actually something here in the credits, so I'll let you watch that. And be sure to check all the channel links. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Pressure from Gotham citizens, Mayor Hill has just announced his resignation. While Hill has not ruled out a possible run for re-election in the new year, his resignation means that Peter Grogan will likely not be the next police commissioner of Gotham. Speculation has already begun about who the new mayor will appoint as commissioner, with many pundits naming GCPD Captain James Gordon as the frontrunner. And now to South Gotham, where Vicki Vale brings us this live report. Thanks, Janine. I'm standing at the corporate headquarters of Goth Corp, where Captain Gordon has confirmed that Goth Corp CEO Ferris Boyle has been taken into police custody. Police report that Mr. Boyle stands accused of manslaughter, extortion, and attempted murder. Shocking accusations given that just earlier tonight, he accepted the Wayne Foundation's award for Humanitarian of the Year. Also in custody is the notoriously elusive underworld crime boss Oswald Cobblepot, better known as the Penguin, as well as a Goth Corp cryogenicist, Victor Freeze. 
Mr. Freeze is being held under heavy guard at Gotham General, receiving treatment for an undisclosed medical condition. Quincy Sharp has suggested that Mr. Freeze is yet another example of the type of criminal that needs the specialized care that only Arkham Asylum can provide. Police credit these arrests to solid police work, but this reporter suspects the vigilante known as the Batman had more than a small role to play. On a personal note, I owe Batman a debt of gratitude for rescuing me from almost certain death earlier this evening. So, thank you, Batman. For all of us. Back to you, Janine. Thanks, Vicky. The Batman continues to be one of the top stories this holiday season. So as we here at GNN wish you all a happy and safe New Year's Eve, we'll leave you with just a few of the comments you've made about Gotham's caped crusader. I was surrounded. Next thing you know, bam, boom, kapow! The bastards are all on the ground, KO'd. I didn't even see him coming. Oh, it was all a blur. He just whooshed in out of nowhere. Listen, I'm a cop. I can't condone what he does. But I can be grateful he's doing it. Oh, he's real, all right. I got the bruises to prove it. He's real, he's ruthless, and there ain't nothing in the world that's gonna stop him. Congratulations, sir. Victor, Ferris, and even that scoundrel Cobblepot are all in custody. Shall we call it a night, then? Not yet, Alfred. There's still work to be done.